and a little more. So I don't know where we're going to be six months from now, so putting it off was not an option. That's why she decided to throw the ultimate prom. The Eagle Ridge Event Center in Pueblo donated the space. But like many parents, she worried about other kids not showing up. And we knew we had lots of adults coming to the party and a few disabled kids, but in order for it to feel like a prom, I knew we needed high school kids dancing and doing the things that these kids can't do. She posted on social media for them to come. Sure enough, Pueblo County High School Junior Eloise Bardwell saw the post. First I just said, I'll just invite my brother. And then I was like, I think it'd be a really good idea if my whole team could come. She rallied not only her volleyball team, but students in both District 60 and 70. We did like the dancing, we did like pictures with her, we did pictures with each other, and we were just like all out there together. To help create a true prom experience. These are things that bring the community together. And she wants to continue the tradition to help other kids just like Amaria. I want to help other parents feel what I felt. So we're going to do it next year. We're going to crown a new king and a new queen, and we're going to do it every year moving forward. One, two, three, Hornets! In Pueblo, Mayo Davison, News 5.